Okay, voll das Schuck. Wenn ihr gerade dann gerade kennt, dann kommt man nicht in ein Maschelisch. Okay, so, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Beep, beep, beep. Und jetzt mal nachdenken, dass alle so das wegen. Oh, ah, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh? How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beer dar, dude. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna go over here. Wow, the kids really wipe this place out. Nothing I like it. You for such a tacky style. Love his accessories. Ja, itt fogja megtalálni a, a széfet. <gül> hát igen, ezt akkor ugye nyilvánvaló volt, hogy itt mindig meg kell ezt nézni azt, amit már az előző rész végén megnéztünk. Igen, ez zárva van. Jackpot! Hey, uh, check out my giant melons. Oh. See, you just cut a hole in it. Mm -hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in watermelon. That's who ya? Yeah, we didn't tell them to number one cow. Second most. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. Na igen, és itt hagytuk abba. Harem, scarum? Dimitri, mert már ebből csöptök, ezt a kemsztor. These flyers are promoting a traveling show called Harem Karum. Ugye, ezek az, ez valami, ez egy... Utazó show promotát, ezt a három kerümöt, the date listened indicates that it took place over six years ago. Tehát ez hat évvel ezelőtt volt itt ez a valami. This crap. Mm -hmm. Holy moly! Look, my what I took. Which one are you going to? Na csávó kavon. Hm. Nincs más semmi más. Na. Hello, old friends. Oh yeah. Yes, it's not Jacob. An opportunity like this. Okay, have you all ever seen a grown man crap his pants? Because you're about to. Oh my! All right, now where should I hide? Jacob! Emma? Hello? Look, if you're trying to scare me, it's not gonna work. Ah! 
not scared of clowns? What? No, they're they're funny. You think this is supposed to be funny? I mean, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Do you think it's funny now, little boy? I, oh, because. You want to join 20 of my sexy clown friends in a tiny car that somehow fits us all like it's no big deal? I. I. Yeah. What? Moment's gone. <sighs> Not forgotten. What are we looking for? <clears throat> lodge renovation plans. Blueprints for structural repairs of the lodge chimney column. That uh, in a uh, javitás jut mutató a, a kémény javításához. Judging by the screwed annotations, this is not something that has the money to action right now. Ez van olyasmi, amire most ennek a kriszeketnek nincs pénze. You, uh, what you done to your foot there? That looks painful. Shut up. Done. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Fucking mother love. Good golly, Miss Molly. No wonder I kept this place locked up. I think he'll be pissed when we made a stash. What? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um, <clears throat> human rights or whatever. Sure. Yeah. All right. Now let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh, hell yeah. In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. Jay? Evidence. <clears throat> And at Hackett's quarry, that's no different. There's there are you take off. in these woods. Fun secrets that, should you uncover them, could help protect you from criminal prosecution. After all, the stories you'll take with you are only stories without the proof to back them up. So it's time to dive into the mystery, take pictures, or find pieces of evidence. And you may just prove your innocence. Or not. Hehehehe. <laughs> <coughs> Hehehehe. again. What again? What now? Jacob, check this out. What? I can't move or else the door will latch. They look like camping supplies. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. The truth is out there. Yeah, I need to throw for an edge. Torn bags. Torn hiking bags dashed with flecks of dried blood. Hát ilyen mászó felszerelés és rászáradt vér borítja. Oh, cool. What? What is it? 
a gun. Oh, cool. And a code. Hat var inte har mitt skinnet. Ja, safe. I'm done. <laughs> so you're uh you're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah. For bears. Mm-hmm, I'm about to wake me up. Okay. Uh well I am gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp. That's why he told me to get out. Make a crash now, is it safe? Shotgun says. Uh, just some fireworks. Oh, oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. You know. I was sick. You're right. Fireworks. <laughs> hey, hell yeah! Fireworks. Oh. Best uh, children. And might I just add, um, fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> Jacob is got up not I found these like torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. Oh, dude. Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. What are butter pops? Uh, no. What? <laughs> I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um <clears throat> pop pop peanut butter butter pops. <laughs> pop 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 them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my god. They're like the greatest snack of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No. No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. They're like their own thing. Like their own subgenre. Oh, no, you fell with these good butter snack, right? Since I was a kid, you are in for such a treat. Yeah, that color auto never did it. On that bag. Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like twenty years old, aren't okay. they? Okay, look, they predate expiration dates. What? Well, you're gonna love them. Blah. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Booty. Oh, it means like, um, like treasure or buds? <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, I see. <sighs> Ladies first. Um, yep. Which way? Packet Square is Lodge. It's just an mm. office. This is where the magic happens. 
<laughs> okay, yeah, let's just make this quick. Sure, just give me a sec to get this going. And engage. Podcasts. Yeah. All right. Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, bizarre yet bona fide. So, like, ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, yeah, like the the weird and the wonderful. Digging up the stories and discussing if they're bona fide. Boner, fide. Get it? Boner. <laughs> Your wit knows no bounds. So, should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. I mean, come on, what kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children gonna have anyway? <laughs> Not Mr. H, I know, he's cool. It's always been cool to me. Hey, what's the gun for? Uh, Chris, Mr. H told me it was for, um, bears. Bears? Here? Yeah, yeah, he said they don't really come around because he's got the gun to... Yeah. <laughs> Just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. Dude, what if we're out partying tonight out in the woods and we end up in a sort of most dangerous game situation? Like when people hunt other people? Yeah. Yeah. What I mean, think about it. It's yeah, the game is over and hunting season has just begun. True. What if what if okay, bear with me here. What if what's on the menu tonight is us? Well, then I guess we would need to protect ourselves. Exactly. That's why we need the gun mm. for protection. Yeah, not going to happen. What about for fun? No? Okay. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, totally. Well, we know where the gun is if we need it. Your call, man. No, we have a pretty skeleton. Well, hello, what is this? You hear that? Is that a trap door? <laughs> I knew that there was a secret sex dungeon around here somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> I bet you Mr. H is into some real kinky shit. Uh, I doubt it. Weren't there a couple of counselors who never showed up? Uh-huh. Why? Secret. Sex dungeon. Yeah, it's not funny. It probably just goes to the basement <laughs> or something. Open it up. All right. Well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness. So you're being dramatic. Climb down. Take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You opened it. You climb down. One more simple. Eh, on second thought, I'd rather not know what Mr. H is into. More mysterious that way. Sure. Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to this. You better hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> Ringy dingy ding. Oh, sorry, bud. Gotta take this one second. Hello, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. What can I do for you on this darn tootin' doozy of a day? Is that your impression of Mr. H? Uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I, you're absolutely right. He does need to be nicer to Dylan. And, uh, what's that? You want him to give Dylan his phone number? That's a little forward, but I can see what I can do. Smooth. <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> 
Oh, wait, not Laura. Uh, Laura Kearney <clears throat> and Max Brindley. Oh, yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. Yeah, it's because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. Clue discovered. A list of consulars' name, personal details, and their tax, tasks at camps. Egy lista a résztvevők neveiről, személyes adatok és az ő feladatok a táborban. Két név az át van húzva, Laura Kearney and Max Brinley. Why didn't they show up? Miért nem mutatkoztak ők? Persze, hogy a kurva nap megint még fél ötkör is kisütött, eddig esett az eső, de semmi gond. Can't you like speed it up at all? I can try to encourage them. Go for it. You guys can do it. It's not working. It's really gonna have to wait. So, got anything going on when you get back home? School or? Uh, jury's out. Understood. Girlfriend? Uh, not exactly. Boyfriend? Boyfriend? I don't know them. Free agent. Cool, yeah. Me too. Are the, uh, phones... Uh, they could probably use a little while longer. Ah. Okay. So, if you do go to school in the fall, have you, like, picked out a major, or...? I don't know, man. It's kind of hard to talk about right now. Oh, have you not decided what you're going to do with your life? Hey, are the phones done yet? Hey, so did I tell you... Dude! Right. Yo, my guy, toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? Yeah, uh, of I'm course. Sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? Hardy har har. Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's... You're not a little bit curious? I'm not gonna touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise that, but... Nothing but net. <laughs> You're using that wrong. Oh. Huh. Fashion icon. Mr. H knows what he likes. I'm sure he does. Wow, there's... Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't... Holy moly, what the hell is this place? Whoa, what the fuck? These monitors, this is the camp. Huh. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. I mean, no, no, he can't be. These are just, they're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids, unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just, probably just trail cameras. What are trail cameras? People set them up to catch weird, random shit. Okay, yeah, like what? Like, uh, Bigfoot sightings, you know, that kind of thing. So, okay, I'm going to upgrade Mr. H from super creepy pervert with a 
spy cam to, you know, super crazy conspiracy hunter. To be fair, Bigfoot's not a conspiracy. Okay, fine. How about an aspiring cryptozoologist? Hey, maybe he likes the podcast that you listen to. Sure, yeah, let's go with that. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Uh, yeah, okay, I do. It's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just hidden by stuff. Yeah, that's what a secret is, Ryan. It, it's weird. It's major league yeah, weird. I man. don't disagree with you, but... It, it's It's got to be something juicy in here. Dylan, okay. it's, it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. I'm sure that won't be an awkward conversation, like, at all. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. All right. I, I'm leaving this secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret layer. Az persze, valaki kapcsolta a kamerát, vagy lebaszta, de valószínűleg semmi. Oké, ezek a boring. Okay, as me as us. Hol van meg testvén? A gitar. Some pretty heavy duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe let's not touch that. Yeah, there's nothing fun. Ibuprofen. Yannick. Oh, opa, I'm your element. Ibuprofen is fine, don't chill up, you know. Nice. Up. Hey, Dunzo. All right, cool. Let's go. Thank you. A két volt, kimenek az erdőbe. Vagy megmondta neked csávó? It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. They can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. They always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. The art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Okay. 
which way should we go? Why don't you choose? Shedley Glade or Rocky Road? On your Rocky Road, bro. Good choice. Better sticks this way. Better sticks? Yeah. They're like burning or whatever. Think we've got enough? Uh. Not yet. So this place was an actual quarry? Uh, yeah. Apparently some of the caves are in pretty deep. It's like a honeycomb under there. Cool. Well, it's a very big cave, and what is this? All about the leg, mere. Man, neck. Da, I would be sure to cure one of them. Shit, I'm not going to be able to. Danger falling rocks, Kazdorik. Are you sure this is safe? What, are you scared? No. Are you? No. Yes, I am. Karmsug needs that girl X. Faszom már forgott a kamerát, azt tudom, honnan jöttünk. we die it's heavy man no I mean like the future yeah sometimes all the time it's overwhelming <clears throat> I know what you mean sometimes I just try to like let it happen you know huh? like whatever happens is what was meant to happen like it's all predetermined I wouldn't call it that exactly. <clears throat> A predetermined future. Maybe the direction stays the same, but the details change. Like, it changes as you go. You're still in control of your own... Fate? Yeah. I don't know. Seems a little defeatist. No, see, this way I can do whatever I want and not feel bad about it. Within reason. Guess that is a little freeing? In a sociopathic kind of way. <laughs> I 
Ich vergaue mich nicht zu erkennen. Mein Junge geht hier über Bord. Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah, I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course, I just don't know what. <laughs> You'll figure it out. Did you hear that? Hmm? It's probably nothing. Listen, there's something there. Oh, look! It's so tiny. Oh my god, he's so cute. Oh, hold on. Save that you don't breath. <laughs> Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting them which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Huh? Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, causing serious consequences. Oh, again. Okay, did you get all that? Huh? I thought you were gonna draw me getting French by a wild pig. Ah, oh, got it all up here. This is not my first job. The graphics are genuine. Oh, 
Onu bir şey böyle feyelim kazayacağım orama. Tüyüzcüktü <gülüyor> hey. phone back and it's just a big dumb brick Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, now. Back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Knock it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter check. Kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Still no service. Ah, yeah. So, pretty boring. I wonder, maybe a satellite fell out of the sky or something? Yeah, and landed in the forest, waking from her slumber, the hack ha hack it. Okay. You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick! Just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Oh my gosh, it can't be. The hog of Hackett's quarry? What? I thought you hated that phrase. <laughs> Big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. Oh, I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and keep it to where I need a little pick me up. <laughs> okay. I am thinking you are making fun of me. delivery. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where the hell did that gun come dude, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and... We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop! I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely. <laughs> There is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me, old-fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! 
Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. All right. Yeah. Guess we're gonna have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. <laughs> okay, so just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. I've never Jim Lewis does not get the a snack kid. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you actually... Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so is it just me? Is it kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. So, um, how's your little one on one with Abby in the woods? Fun. How is your little one on one with Emma? Oh, dude, it's incredible. She's totally still into me. <laughs> Long distance thing. Is that what she wants? I want to know what she wants. I mean, you could ask her. Thank <laughs> you. That's funny. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please, just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. All right. Combat. Safety tip seven. I'm sorry to have to say there may well be times during your stay at Hackett's Quarry where you'll have to defend yourself <laughs> using potentially deadly force. When engaging in combat, simply aim your weapon and shoot where the flashlight is pointed. Take note, if you're up close and personal with your target, you'll do more damage. The farther away, the larger the spread, and injuries may not be fatal. There's a time and place for the use of weapons, and you may want to consider all your options. Remember, it's not always wise to pull the trigger. That's how people get hurt. I'm sure because I got it back. Also, yeah, what? All right, Nick, one point. Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. <laughs> All right, Nick. This time for real. Nice shot. Lucky. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. All right. You might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. 
I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, dude, not with this freaking cannon dude. blaster. That is how you get someone shot. God. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. <sighs> Sorry, Jacob. Better luck next time. <laughs> Butter luck next time? Hey, I didn't want to <laughs> say it, but you're both very mean. <laughs> Blam, we thought this was over. What the whoa. Pop pop peanut butter butter pots. Oh shit, I'm coming here. Du, du, du. <laughs> ja, host is in it, man. I was just on get there. Okay. New idea. Party game. Mm. Come on, people. We might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies? Truth or dare? Truth or dare, but dare instead. Okay. House rules are: someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose. Well, that's what you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So like normal truth or dare. Yes. So we can like make people kiss if they choose dare. Yeah, as long as everyone consents, of course. Cool beans. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's your turn. But well, who does get to go first? Well, it's house steals, so Abigail. Truth or dare. Really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I, uh, I. Hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on, I, I'm not finished. Um, Have you ever slept there is, uh, at this camp? Then is annoyed by an interruption. No. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um. Oh, Abby! Oh my God! Just pick someone. Okay. Okay. Um. I don't know. Ugh. Ding ding ding! Too late. My turn. Ryan, truth or dare? Truth. I'm an open book. Okay, okay. Let's get right down to it. Let's do. You and Mr. Hackett. Here we go. What were you doing in his office? Well, I know what you're fishing for, but it's actually super boring. If you must know, I need to advice, huh? Oh, whoa, whoa, M. Okay, I got this. Okay, so uh, if you go to settings, there's an option called incognito mode, and if you press that, no life advice <laughs> about school. And, and that's no fair. I've I've already answered my question. Maybe we can help. Uh, I don't know. You've all got your own shit going on. Besides, I, I figured just the mention of the word school would cause Jacob to hemorrhage or something. Whoa. Dude, what the hell did I do? 
Alrighty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. Well, took my left for Gianna's at Jora. Cause I'm safe on you for the Valam Siastok. Hmm. 